You know they say that Cat Shaft is a bad mother. Shut him up. Ignore him. He thinks he's a black James Bond. That dude was real. He think it was me. Cat Shaft is, you know, legendary. He's the he's the best dresser. He's the toughest guy. He's the sexiest guy. He is everything that has est on it that you could imagine. The world I would be without your fatherly wisdom. <laughs> Better late than now. The next generation of Shaft, um, it feels, it feels great. It feels oh, dynamic. Well, I got more Shaft in him than I thought. Yeah, I hope there's a prescription for that. Uh, Sam said the first black action hero. That's, uh, that's nice to hear. If you're gonna pursue this investigation, I'm gonna have to babysit your ass. You know, for a woman to feel safe with a man emboldened enough to really be completely unapologetic for everything, Sasha. you know, it was very sexy because there's nothing sexier than confidence. You know what I mean? So Shaft has a confidence that you just don't see. The man pays for your dinner before you have sex with him. Try it. Good seeing you. Bad seeing you. When we were working this whole coke thing out, and we finally got a call where Giorgio Armani said he wanted to make the coat. And it's kind of like, wow, OK. Something just came over me. I'm walking through the street, 42nd Street and all that traffic and all that noise. It was a magical moment. The way you dress does change the way you feel, sort of. And you, I don't know, putting on the trench coat was like, you felt powerful, you know, you felt strong. <laughs> Got a pretty raucous life going on, you know, because when you first see him, he's doing some shaft stuff, which is great for the first time. I'm the first chef, I, I just kept asking, I'm like, where's the sex machine for all the chicks? I go, we're gonna get to it. I'm like, so at least we get to it quickly in this one. You damn right. What's up? <laughs>